Hi guys, welcome to OG Cars, and in today's video, we are looking at the lovely little Alpha Suit. And we're going to talk about why I'm planning for it to go. So here she is, our lovely 1977 Alfa Romeo Alphasus. Now she's absolutely lovely, sounds amazing, great to drive, fantastic condition. I mean, we had an amazing experience with this car coming back from Italy. I won't go too much into all of the stuff on this car because we've already done that. We've got the Italy trip number two, and we've got the introducing video where we did this, and um, we've got the service video as well. So if you guys are interested in that, go back and watch those videos on the car. But for those of you wondering, these are the reasons why this car and others have to go. So basically it boils down to a couple of main reasons and that is cost and space. If we go firstly into cost, let's just say that the house and the garage roof are way into five figures. So basically we're going to have to recoup some costs somehow. G has paid out X amount of money and I have already, but the, the roof costs themselves and a couple of other things are going to fall solely on me um, because G has uh, cars like that and I have cars like this. <laughs> um, but ultimately, um, I'm, not, I'm not trying to be harsh. She's, she's paid for it. She has paid for um, a lot of stuff and, and so have I. But ultimately, we have to recoup some costs somewhere. So that's the plan is sell some cars and pay for more on the house. We've got to make some adult decisions and we have a lot of cars already. Like I miss the Audi. I miss the Wartburg. I miss, I, I miss the Fiat 126, I've never driven it, and I miss it because it's in my garage and I just haven't been to it for ages. The last time I went to it, I had to move it out of the way to get the Panda trailer out, that's all I've done with it. And it's a bit sad really, so I need to sell some stuff and move some stuff that I already have back over here at some point. So, cost, yeah. The Panda Sizzly, which will be for sale, and this are higher value cars to me, so ultimately they will recoup some more of that cost. Now onto space. Now, basically our roof is being done, so the scaffolding is all across the front there. And we can't use the top garage. We can barely get as many cars around here. We need to leave some space for all the builders and all the rubbish and everything um, while it is waiting to be cleared up. So until all of this stuff has cleared and gone, we need to get rid of some stuff now so that we can move around. So this and the Sizzly are gonna go. The Sizzly's out there, which, you know, is. I'd like the scissor to be in a garage as well, but basically both of these was... She just disturbs my videos. <laughs> no! <laughs> right, well, I've just tried to stop a dangerous situation where the cat and very gammy feet have just walked on the officer's bonnet. And now she's angry at me, so I'm gonna put her down. Um, yeah, that is hanging anyway, I need to clean it. Um, we did drive it out to do these pictures for a car and classic advert um, for the auction. And uh, since then, I drove it back, washed it underneath. I've religiously washed this underneath every time I've driven it out, um, which is very unlike me. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been a bit dusty and everything, so I need to clean it off properly. But let's talk about the auction, actually. So the auction, we had the pictures, we put it all up. They did their write-up on Car and Classic, and it went up, and it finished last night at 5,200, which ultimately wasn't what I was looking for. I was looking for a bit more. It does owe us more than that anyway. Um, if any of you guys are genuinely interested, do drop me a message because I would consider an offer over that. Um, yeah, just let me know. It's going up, I believe, on Car and Classics Make an Offer thing, uh, post auction sales um, for 10 grand, but I've asked them to drop it to eight or near offer. So basically it'll be listed up on websites for eight grand. And if anyone wants to make an offer, just go for it. I mean, I want it to go to a good home. So it's as simple as that, that's, that's what it's going to be. I'll list this car up for sale and the Sizzly will be going to auction first. And again, if it doesn't sell, it'll go to one of these make an offer things. So keep an eye out for that if you want to buy that. Um, but yeah, that's it. The auction has ended and it didn't sell for what I wanted to be. So it will be going up for sale um, on the classifieds. So if you guys are interested in that, please go and check it out. Thanks very much for watching this video. Like, comment and subscribe and we shall see you guys in the next one.